Okay. Now, where will we put our university? Possibly here? No, let's see. Ooh, actually, let's do it adjacent. Now, will this light up the way I want it to? Probably not. Nothing ever does in this game, but. Or, that's a nice spot there. I like that, that's nice. And so that'll be a positive influence on the industrial tech level. Looking good. Definitely looking good. Okay, let's just put some more upgrades into our services. I think the police might use a bit more SC stalls. And that way everyone knows it's the police station. <laughs> Flag too. And yeah, we have 75,000 is our next population goal, so we should try and increase the land value. Try and get some more um, the larger buildings in here. improve upon it. Yeah, you can already see it's, it's helping out. That is cool. Alright. And so let's maybe put in a, um, a port. Transits, boats, and some sea activity. What I've essentially done is I've closed it off to um, basically freight, so it's just going to be a commercial. But really, that's, that's totally cool. Maybe we'll just keep that a high density, just so it looks even. Kind of see over here how it's all like crappy ground looking. Go over to the nature section, we can drop in some trees. And that's basically going to pull the ground pollution away. I'll clean up the area. So let's just make a little bit of a 
forest kind of through our town. So this helps with pollution and it gives a nice little visual kind of boost to the city as well. And you get all these charming bird noises in the interim, right? Let's go crazy with trees. Never have enough trees. I read somewhere that they make the air that we breathe. <laughs> That's the most obvious thing out there. Okay, that's cool. City looks a bit more like a city now. to use now. Alright, so let's maybe make some industry. Let's go, um, because I'm sure we'll be getting some high-tech buildings in here pretty soon, if not already. So let's delete just this little part right here. I'm sorry people, I know you hate me, but let's do it. And then we're going to put in train. So we're going to put in a people train, and then we're going to put in a trade train. And the people train, I guess we'll go... Mm, not too close to there, actually. I almost want it to be... maybe here. Now, will this somehow magically just line up? No. Oh, that's okay. I don't actually want it to connect. I just want that. And then, what we'll do on the other parts. is, um, oops. oh, I guess that doesn't have to do that. Uh, when we can, we'll build the, um, next part of the trade thing. And then that will allow us to put the rail access. So we'll leave this spot just for that. And we'll put a bus stop over here. Now we just kind of get people commuting to our town just through different different ways. Okay. So now that we got some tourists that can make their way into the town, why don't we drop like a little casino or something just so we can get a bit more side revenue. Um, let's actually put it over here. And we'll get some upgrades. Run the marquee. Get a hotel. So we're going to put in a lounge that attracts people. And then have them hang out in the blackjack. And nickel slots. Cool. So, secondary income kind of puts our tourists to use. The commercial obviously benefits from from this, because then now they're going to make like hotels and stuff, so. And we are getting there. Our town is slowly evolving. Yeah, definitely a nice little place we got here. And we should 
should have enough to build the electric. Yeah, we do. Um, how much do we need? Do we need da, 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 three different types in trade? Okay, cool. So our other ones will come from. Oh, actually, if I put this over here, I can. Yes, I can upgrade it that way. Okay, so let's. Put in a processor plant, that's a great source of income. And let's just drop all the upgrades in. Oh, too far from, oh, okay, great. Close call. And we are essentially flat broke, okay. Very good investment of the money though. So now, we're gonna have to give it its own trade. And so the resources we need, we need plastic. And we need alloy. And then we'll need somewhere to store the processors. So um, we don't need this to be freight. So we'll have plastic, alloy, and processors. And so to make this function properly, we need to import the plastic, we need to import the alloy, and then we need to export the um, processors. And so it's gonna cost us about, meh, what is that, around 60,000 or so, roughly to make it, and then we'll be selling it for 76, so. We will be churning a profit, luckily, from that right off the get-go. Because you won't be able to rely just on the hourly budget forever. Because as the city services kind of increase in size, like when you put in the new fire stations and hospital, you are you might not have enough. Like you're eventually going to kind of hit that tipping point where you start sinking into the negatives, really, no matter what you do. So you're going to have to kind of supplement the um, income. And let's put a cruise ship in. We got our passengers. And then tourists, they come through like, you know, the double-decker bus terminal, they're going to come through the uh, high-speed rail, and they're going to come through the ferry terminal. And hopefully all make their way to the uh, casino, that's already making us money. Mm hmm things are looking up here. And these should now have, oh, not quite yet, but, oh, I forgot to put the trucks in. How silly of me. Excellent. Nice little place we have. Definitely nice. Okay, let's see how rush hour is. Now that we're coming up on a new day. Look at that. No real spots of concern anymore. Not like the old days. Still gets backed up, right? But Not like what it used to be. Yeah, that's a good view. Oh, that's that's infinitely better. That's actually incredible how much better it is. Maybe make these high just going through, yeah.
definitely a good looking town. And very profitable too. Why is our alloy not coming in? We're recording it. Kind of see, there comes the alloy trucks. Did you drop off alloy? Well, that's interesting. It doesn't actually seem to be dropping off my alloy. Mm, let's investigate. Here comes another alloy truck. Let's see if this time it'll drop off some alloy. And fingers crossed. Fantastic. Oh, you know what? We probably didn't have the money before. That's fine. Whereas, yeah, now we would. Okay, so I think mystery has been solved. definitely have enough plastic, so this is now going to start churning out some processors and we'll be able to sell those. We will have to put a second plant in, just because the one isn't going to be enough to kind of get to the next level of the trade um, it's, uh, leaderboard, or whatever the word I'm trying to find is. Hmm, I don't want to put that in just yet, because I know our trade volumes aren't really there. Okay. 